During this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can use the short codes feature inside of the InstaBuilder 2.0 visual editor to add content from outside of the plugin. You know, we want you to be able to use other plugins on WordPress and a lot of other plugins use short codes like contact forms and such. They give you a short code that you can use to implement on your WordPress website. So I want to show you how you can use that feature on your web pages. So for this example, here I am on the dashboard, I am going to be using a plugin that is called CTA Pro. So I'm going to click on it over here. And basically what this plugin is, is it allows you to create your own little buy buttons, uh, guarantees, and things like that. And when you create it, it gives you a short code to use. So for example, I already have one created here. I'm going to go to edit so we can see what it looks like. If I scroll down here, pretty much all I have right now is this one-time offer graphic that I want to appear on my web page. Now, if I wanted to, I could add, let's say a decoration, for example, I could add a button here. Let me choose that and drag that here. And then maybe I could add some text to this button real fast. Maybe I have something like that, okay? So what I do, I'm going to here, I'm going to save my little design I have, and they are going to give me a short code. As we can see here, this is my short code. So I'm going to copy that, and this works for any plugin that gives you a short code. It doesn't have to be this plugin. I'm going to go back to my InstaBuilder dashboard here. I am going to go to one of my pages here that I have created. I'm going to click on Edit and bring this up here. And now when you are on the page, what you can do is on your left hand side under your elements, you want to go to the short code placeholder, which is here. You're going to click and you're going to drag that wherever you want to place that short code. So let's say I want to place it above my buy button here. I put it there and you're going to see that it says insert short code here. I'm going to click on that. I'm going to click on the little gear symbol here. And over here on the right hand side, you want to place your short code there. You're going to do that. Now I'm going to hide this panel. And although I don't see it in the preview here, I am going to save this and we're going to go to preview so we can see what that looks like on our sales page. All right, once that loads up there, you can see it kind of pops up there using our short code. Now, obviously I would edit this and make this look a little bit better for our sales page here, but I just want to show you that you can use any short code off the top of my head, I know the CTA plugin I'm using here uses short codes. The Contact Form 7 plugin uses short codes. So you could easily insert a contact form on your website using the short code from Contact Form. And all you have to do is drag the short code element to wherever you want that short code to appear at. Click on the gear symbol and then paste your short code and that's all you have to do.